today we're going to be looking at a song called The Choice. It's one of the better songs I've written and one of the more challenging songs to play. Uh, we played it in Voyager back in 1986 or so and uh, really enjoyed doing it. It's a great song and uh, it's, it's played unconventionally on the guitar. We played it in the key of G, uh, as I'll show you on the 12 string guitar. With a D tuning, uh, drop D tuning. And so the guitar is tuned down a whole step. And so we have uh, this here, even though this would be a G chord with the drop D tuning, uh, it's now an F chord. And uh, the, the picking pattern goes like this. The singing occurs uh, when the band picks up speed and uh, takes off in a gallop, and it goes something like this. <laughs> It's a D flat there, and a D flat major, but you would have a sour note if you played this note here, so I deaden it with this finger. Back to G. Yeah, I played that note there and it's sour. There's a G minor, but what I do is I deaden the low string with this thumb here. Let me go up here to uh, an A minor. So the the problem I the challenge I had was to uh, reintroduce the 12 string guitar. So what I've done is I've taken the 12 string, leaving it in the, the standard tuning, uh, then dropping the D down, but moving it up a step and a half of this capo here. And uh, by doing that, I end up playing F in a D configuration. It just occurred to me that there's something interesting about the national guitar. This little crater you see right here at the end of my fingertip. That is from a drumstick that flung out of Ken Herford's hand back in 1974 when we were practicing. It flew out of his hand and struck the guitar on end. It dented the string that was on the guitar at the time as well. Uh, it didn't damage the guitar's playability, but uh, 
it's been with me ever since that little crater there and I haven't had a need to get a fix the place fine but uh, just goes to show you it's dangerous playing with drummers with the challenge about uh, playing this song and these different tunings is that the guitar chords uh, and their names aren't what we usually see when we play the guitar and if you've watched the video and you're a guitar player you're probably looking at all those chords and thinking well that doesn't make sense and yeah it's it's hard to do it's it's hard to keep track of all of them uh, when you're playing uh, in different tunings and then each guitar has its own different tuning um, you gotta look at all those chords and remember that you're playing a step down and you're also playing in different tunings and that can really throw you off so there's a good chance that some of those notations that you've just seen in this video are wrong I've done my best uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video as uh, we, we proceed through the Voyager project and if something interesting comes along I'll make another video for you until then, enjoy the music.